They call me X7 Albert. All right, yo guys, what is up? It is CJ or Swoopy bringing this video on Skate 3 as usual. Now, if you guys are wondering why I'm playing on Mega Park, just because I don't know, I've been enjoying this little spot on Mega Park. It's really chill. It's really easy to hit clips, and it's just really fun to play on. Plus, I'm just telling a story, so it's not like I'm going for insane clip or anything or insane gameplay. So today, I'm gonna be telling a story about the time I I don't I don't know how to explain it. <laughs> about the time I protected my brother, aka broke this kid's glasses, aka butt slammed this kid at Burger King. That's pretty much his whole story. All right, bye. Ah, psych! So, anyways, there was 20-something. I don't, I don't... I don't know. Okay, I really don't know how old I was. I was like... Okay, so I was like five or six, maybe even seven, even maybe even four. I don't remember. And my brother is three years older than me, so he was, give or take, around eight, nine, maybe even seven. I don't know. It all depends, really, how old I was. I don't remember, though. But we went out of town with my grandma so she could go to a doctor's appointment because we were too young to be left alone and if you guys don't know i've lived with my grandparents for a majority of my life uh, on both sides of the family so back when my grandma was well uh she was going to a doctor's appointment i don't know exactly for what i don't it was it was like it was like 11 years ago so i really don't remember all i remember is she allowed me and my brother to go like down the street to burger king to go play in the play place when burger king had a play place most burger kings i see nowadays don't have play places the one in my town actually used to have one until it got infested by bugs because it was outside so we were just playing and then this blonde kid with glasses randomly just started talking to us uh i don't i don't know i he was showing my brother like karate and he was like taking my brother down and uh hurting my brother and i i, I honestly kind of like wasn't understanding what he was doing i thought he was legitimately just trying to hurt my brother oh i legit just thought he was trying to hurt my brother so you know young cj the young god which is sitting there trying to you know think what, what 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 can i do so i get on top of a higher platform right and i decided hey i'm gonna butt slam this kid so i jumped from probably okay I, I was shorter this at this time i would want to say maybe three four feet off the ground i jump off that and i i butt slam this kid in the face and it's not even just like i i like hit him like i i legit butt slammed him on the face and i'm pretty sure his glasses were broken he was crying i might have broken his nose who knows like honestly the scariest part about this whole story isn't the part that i hurt someone isn't the part about he was trying to hurt my brother or whatever isn't the part that i jump four feet whatever and butt slam him it's the fact that i don't even know what happens to the kid they could be dead maybe i killed him maybe i killed him with the butt slam no but uh me and my brother left the scene we just went back to the doctor's office and uh because i think his dad showed up or something and like he was like yes yeah, so we just dipped the hell out of there so you know that kid could be dead uh yeah or or slightly retarded one or two or you know he could just be fine i, I hope that's the ultimate answer that was a little bit of a story i've been wanting to tell for a while it's just i didn't really know how to say it or explain it or yeah so yeah i really hope you guys don't think i'm okay i was like i was five no one better judge me for this and yeah the kid was uh asking for it so if you guys did enjoy this live story or you know just a little bit of story about how i murdered someone then leave a like and a comment and also subscribe to my channel because you know you know the drill that'd be freaking awesome that sounds so white that'd be freaking awesome that'd be highly appreciated guys i'd i'd, I'd freaking love it hashtag rip roscoe and I really hope that kid with the glasses is okay and not retarded or dead. So yeah, shout out to Venice and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.